Hello and welcome to another Royal Reviewer channel episode and in today's episode I am going to be doing another unboxing haul from my Amazon wishlist which I will put the link to in the description of this video. So without further ado I've actually got three things. I've got one, two and three. A big one. Um, but we'll get to that at the end. Now, as always, just to save a little bit of time, and because unboxing with one hand is quite tricky, I have pre-opened the box and the package, but I haven't taken a look inside yet. So, without further ado, which one shall I go for first? I think I'm gonna go for the big box, why not? Are you ready? Revealing one flap, revealing the other. Um, by the way, I would like to point out that even though I actually composed the wish list. Um, I have no idea what these items are because unless I notice which item is actually missing from the wish list, then I really don't know which item it is. So, what will it be? <gasps> I can see bear. Okay, wow. Oh my goodness, I can see the bears. They open box. Wow, look, it's my little royal bears. Oh, let's prop them up. Look, oh, aren't they cute? I will open them in a second. Um, I must have a look at the card. What does it say? Okay, that's just the receipt card. Um, okay, what's this? Ah, here we go. A gift note. Okay, I have got to read you the gift note. The gift note from Sharon Nichols. Sharon, thank you so much. I'm fairly new to your channel and love it. Enjoy your gift from Sharon. Thank you so much, I really do. And this, there's two notes obviously because there's two bears. Enjoy your gift from Sharon. Thank you so much. <gasps> they're lovely and they're just the right size as well. In fact, there was two sizes. There was a bigger size and this smaller size and I wanted the smaller size so that I can use them in the background of my videos. So for example, when the Queen is on her summer break in Balmoral or anything to do with Scotland, I can put the I can put the Scottish Piper bear in the background and in the other times I can use this Buckingham Palace guard bear. Now I've got to open them and um, let me see how good I am at one-handed bear unboxing. <laughs> okay right I think I'm just about managing it. Uh, wow out you come. Out you come indeed. Let me try and get oh it's got the um the saltire of Scotland as well. Okay, I'm having a bit of trouble doing this. I will unbag them and then I will get back to you. And here they are. Wow, look. Oh my goodness, Guardsman Bear with his bearskin hat is so furry. It's really fluffy. And you probably can't even see, but it's really, really, really furry and shiny. Look at the little faces. They are adorably cute. Look, look at the little outfit. Wow, they are so soft as well. Let's have a look at Piper Bear. So we've got the Scottish hat, we've got his pipe, we've got the Scottish saltire on the foot, um, we've got... Let's sit, let's sit him on my knee. Wow, he's amazing. Um, I want to read what the tag says. Let's have a look. So it's by Keel Toys and it's described as Piper Bear by Keel Toys. You are adorable. And let's have a look at Bearskin Bear. Now I want to know what they actually, I want to know what they actually call you. They call you Guardsman Bear. So I was right, he is the Guardsman Bear and with his Bearskin hat. And his uniform looks amazing too. Look at the little epaulets. <gasps> wow, he's amazing too. I love them. They are absolutely adorable and I will most certainly be using them in my upcoming videos. Now, let's put them to one side for a moment. I don't like to move them out of the way, but they will have to make way for this little package. And what could it be? Let me see, I haven't, I haven't peeked. Do you want to peek with me? Ooh, 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 what's that? It's blue. Okay, this, Okay, this is interesting. Let me see if I can get you out. Okay, wow. 
I think this is... <gasps> okay! Oh, this is official um, Buckingham Palace merchandise. Um, and I think I might know who this is from. Um, I think it might be from Marilyn, because she did message me and tell me that there was something coming that wasn't on my wish list. So I, this is actually from the Buckingham Palace official website. Wow, thank you, Marilyn. Let me see if I can open it. Okay, with my handy knee. My handy knee work. Let's see. Okay, I think these might be tea towels. They are Harry and Meghan official merchandise cotton tea towels to celebrate the marriage of H and M, Harry and Meghan. You can see how shiny that is. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle cotton tea towel. Wow. Okay. Just having a quick look. It's actually from the Royal Collection Trust, which is the official... Oh, there's two! Okay, I didn't realise there's two. There's two tea towels. Okay, wow. Are they both the same? Yes. Wow. I mean, I can actually use these. Um, I mean, lots of people. Okay, so these are souvenirs. They are commemorative souvenirs. But they are also practical items. And I'm a great believer in that if you have something nice, that you should actually use it. I mean, why put them in a cupboard where occasionally you might look at them, you might not even t take a look at them for years and years and years. I believe that if you've got something nice, that you should actually use them or wear them, because otherwise, what is the point in having them? So I will most certainly be using these tea towels as tea towels, because they're just gorgeous. And why not? Why would I not want to use them? So let me say, if I can one-handed, um, reveal one of them. Okay. Let me see. Okay, wow. The big reveal. Okay, what a gorgeous design. That is a really good design. To celebrate the marriage of H&M, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Beautiful pattern design. The quality of the cotton feels fantastic. It's really, really good. And I just want to see if there's any wash or care instructions. Okay, there is. I thought so. So it's got the Buckingham Palace logo in gold. And let's read the care instructions. 100% cotton, made in the UK. Wash similar colours together. And I think it says that's a wash at 30 or 40. Okay, I can't quite read the, the embroidered wash thing, but I will most definitely probably be washing it at 30, not 40, just in case. But, wow, I can't believe, I can't believe that I have these amazing gifts. What a haul. Thank you so, so, so much, Marilyn. Now for the big one. Okay, I have an idea what this might be because it's flat. Um, I will show you, I will give you a little clue. See how thin it is? It's really, really thin. So I actually am not going to open this in this video. I'm just going to give you a very sneaky peek. There you go, you can see the package. There is one or two items that it could be off my wish list. And I'm thinking that it's one in particular. And I am going to reveal this in my next live chat. So please join me for episode five of my weekly chat show, Talk of the Crown. And you will see this item revealed in that live chat. So there is one other gift which I am going to wait to reveal in my live chat and I'm only showing you a tiny, tiny fraction of this gift. I will reveal all in my live chat. Episode 5, Talk of the Crown. So if you have enjoyed this video then please give it a big old thumbs up. Don't forget to hit notification bell so that you know whenever I upload a new video. So from me in Shropshire, goodbye. I fooled you, I'm back. I actually found this in the delivery bag of the tea towels. And it's a card which I didn't notice. So let's see what it says. It's a royal gift for you. And it says, hope you enjoy the gift. Thank you for the wonderful live chats each week. Thank you so, so much to Marilyn um, for my lovely royal gift.